Hey, hey everyone, Krellopix here. And today, as you can see, doing something a little bit different than the beta cross stitch. <laughs> um, I figured everyone needed a break from that, including myself. So, um, I was really missing diamond painting. So I was like, let's do some diamond painting. <laughs> Um, just been really busy, um, really like the past couple of months, to be honest, really busy. And then today, um, I have a lot of cleaning to do. I need to finish it before this evening for, um, Lunar New Year. Lots of, it's like spring cleaning and that's gotta be done by this evening and working so hard. And I was like, I need a break. I need to calm myself and relax. And what better way to do that than with some random diamond painting? <laughs> so um, this is the rhinestone Kincaid cottage that I started in in Thailand. Um, sorry, I'm just going to show you a little bit. Um, this piece is full coverage, so it's a full drill. It's also full rhinestone. So everything is rhinestone except for the black. These are opaque. And this one is 80 by 45 centimeters. And had some problems with this piece. I'm going to complete it, but there are problems with this piece. Not gonna complain in this video, not gonna really go over that because this one's supposed to be more relaxing than anything and about sparking joy. <laughs> so um, yeah, there won't be a link for this because there are problems, but diamond painting is diamond painting and I intend to enjoy myself. And what better way to do that than work on a piece that I should have finished a while ago but have not had a chance to work on. <laughs> So let's work on this one today. So if you've got a diamond painting you want to work on, break it out and let's get going. <laughs> so yeah, problems with this one means that I need to revert to, um, you know, back to basics and do one diamond at a time. Um, I was trying to use the three placer on this one, had some issues, so I had to let that go, which is okay. I mean, you still get um, the same, <laughs> if not a little bit better, by placing them down one by one. So it's not a problem. We get over these problems quite quickly. But diamond painting is supposed to be relaxing, and I needed a break. So I was like, let's take a quick 20-minute break, and let's diamond paint together. So yeah, as you can see, I haven't accomplished that much on here, but yeah, I haven't done any diamond painting in a very long while. <laughs> Actually, it's been almost a month, I believe, since I last diamond painted, and that's including working on the, uh... has it been a month? I don't even know anymore, you guys. I don't, I'm pretty sure it's been a month since I last worked on a diamond painting, including the great wall piece. Maybe it hasn't been that long, and it just feels that long. <laughs> I don't know. I can't, I can't keep up. I can't believe it's already February. I'm like, where has the time gone? Where has it gone? But yeah, you just gotta roll with it, I guess. <laughs> That's what I usually tend to do, roll with it. I mean, there's nothing you can do about time passing now, is there? But hopefully soon after Lunar New Year, starting tomorrow, I can just kind of relax a little bit more and do um, crafting at my leisure instead of trying to speed through it like with the beta cross stitch. Don't worry, I will still do a finishing video on that because all that effort, I feel like I need to show it off. I have to show you guys the finished pro project. And I've spent so much effort on it that it's becoming a bit of a pain right now. <laughs> but I feel like once it's all finished and done with, um, I will be so proud and I'll feel that it was totally worth it. So, yeah. I can't wait to show you guys that. And, yeah, it should be really good. And then I can start on 
or I should really stop starting, stop starting, <laughs> stop starting new projects at least for this month and try to get some of these finished. Um, so yeah, but probably this month there will be no new crafts. Maybe who knows? That's not a promise that I can keep. <laughs> I'll just say that right now. <laughs> It's not a promise. I shall endeavor to try. <laughs> but how are you guys going so far this year? I hope that you are enjoying the year. Hopefully it's not passing as fast and as hectic for you as it is for me. Hopefully you can relax a little bit and enjoy things. I wouldn't wish like some of the stress on any... I wouldn't wish it on anyone, so... Ah, the good old rattle of diamond painting. I feel like, you know, I can take a deep breath and just relax. Some people have meditation. I'll just do diamond painting. And usually if I've got some good relaxing music on, oh man, I can totally get lost. All my fears, worries, problems, they just kind of melt away. <laughs> it's the best. How, are you guys still feeling that with diamond painting? Especially the long-time diamond painters now. Are you still enjoying it? Is it still relaxing? I know it's really hard to enjoy when you have such crappy kits and you have to do so much effort and it's not turning out right and that can stress you out. But overall, are you still enjoying the craft? Are you still relaxing with it? Are you still addicted to it? I know I am, and I've been diamond painting for, I guess, almost two years now. So, yeah, that's really saying something. Although I have curbed my diamond painting purchases. I'm, I'm actually really proud of that. <laughs> I have not purchased any new diamond paintings. Um, probably since the last time I purchased this one, that last haul. So I'm very, very pleased at myself for that <laughs> because I have so many epic ones that I want to work on those. Like I, my, mm, what do you call it? My attention hasn't been drawn to anything else besides op a, a, a completely different craft. But um, the images, I'm really stoked about them and I really want to get to them and work on them. So I have not been really inspired to purchase another diamond painting. Don't get me wrong. I do have several on my wish list, <laughs> but I have not wanted to purchase any more yet. Like, you know, I've been able to keep it at bay. So I'm quite chuffed about that. <laughs> And I'm glad to hear that we still have new people being introduced to diamond painting and loving it. And like the kids getting into it, how adorable are they? Oh my goodness, kids getting into diamond painting and concentrating so hard and they just, it's so cute. I think it's absolutely adorable to see these kids diamond painting, doing an absolutely phenomenal job, enjoying themselves and it gives them focus on something so I think it's brilliant absolutely brilliant <laughs> I, I can't wait to finish this piece I'm hoping that you know despite all the problems with it the end product will look glamorous that's what I'm hoping and that my time on this hasn't been completely wasted. Well, I mean, I guess it's never completely wasted because I enjoy doing the craft. And I tend to buy crafts for doing the crafts instead of the end product anyways. So I guess that just kind of goes along with it. But why waste your money on something crappy when you can use that money to buy something good and still get the same enjoyment out of it? So that's my only concern only concern um yep they're still doing construction so i'm really sorry for the noise <laughs> um yeah and it just really just filters through the windows like you wouldn't believe um yeah 
I really have nothing else to say to that. But this is not a complaint video. We're relaxing. <sighs> I am accomplishing something here. I am relaxing. I'm taking a breather. I'm chatting with you guys. Even though it's lonely. <laughs> I am still working. I haven't had a chance to test um, if streaming uh, uses up a lot of data on my phone just yet. Been really busy, but I will get to that soon. And then hopefully we can just, you know, chat together on live stream, chat and diamond paint and relax. Ah. <laughs> that would be fun. You know, I'm not going to complain, but that's why I don't play online games either. Because our internet is just absolutely rubbish. <laughs> but yeah, kind of used to it by now. Lots of things are happening this year. Uh, I've got a few weddings to go to. Very excited about that. Um, I do have another trip coming up. I'll tell you guys more about that later once things are like <laughs> solidified, I guess. Um, yeah, lots of stuff happening. It's going to be an exciting year, 2019. I'm very excited about my friends getting married. It'll be awesome. Do you know anyone getting married this year? How's this year looking for you? Have you got lots planned or are you just, you know, are things just kind of, you know, going as they are? Um, <laughs> what am I trying to say? Like, you know, nothing planned, but, you know, you're just going with the flow. I can't believe I already have things planned for this year, like way in advance. Like, um... Like, I have plans for October already. And I guess when you have plans so far in advance, that also makes you feel like the year is going by really quickly. Because <laughs> you're already planning so far ahead. But that's... that's it's also kind of cool because that means you have so many exciting things to look forward to. So, good times ahead. Oh, this piece is funny. <laughs> I don't have really too much to talk about. All right. That's all I've been doing lately is just babbling. I have been doing so many of these real-time videos. <laughs> and they're fun. They're really fun. But they're also a bit easier for me because I don't have to do as much editing or anything. And then I can still get a video out for you guys. Yay! And update you on my life and my stress <laughs> and what's going on. Because really, you guys, crafting is my life. And yeah, you are seeing my life. <laughs> and yeah, that beat across it. Woohoo! I know I'm going to be really pleased with myself once it's 100% complete. So excited. Same with uh, the Great Wall piece. Oh, I've been itching so much to work on it. I haven't worked on it in a while. And I was like, uh, I want to work on it. I want to finish it. And you, it's just one of those pieces. Yeah, I keep saying this. It's just one of those pieces. Um, because it's such a good kit, it's more than just relaxing, you know. It's a reprieve from all these unfortunately crappy kits that are becoming the norm um so when you do have a good kit you just really appreciate it more and yeah <laughs> i really do miss working on it so that should be next week hopefully get back into that and yeah oh i can't wait to finish that it's gonna be so cool so cool I am very excited. Also, um, Kingdom Hearts 3 was just released uh, last week. 
I didn't pre-order it because I didn't want any of the special editions, so there was really no point. But, um, yeah, I haven't gone out and purchased it yet because I don't have time to play. But um, I'm itching to play. I'm so excited about it. I was like, finally, it's out. Been waiting for years for Kingdom Hearts 3 to come out, and it's finally here. And I haven't, I whenever I see any kind of playthrough videos on YouTube, like on my wall, I, I just quickly scan past them because I don't want any other spoilers than what I had um, than when I played the demo at PAX. And yes, I'm so excited. Um, I did hear that Skrillex is a part of the soundtrack, so I can't wait to hear that and see how that goes. Um, hopefully that's as epic as the soundtracks have been in the past. Very excited, because I, I also have all the soundtracks for, you know, all of the other games. And yeah, the soundtracks do repeat quite often, but I love it. And that's also quite relaxing and nice to listen to when you're diamond painting. <laughs> it is so good. So I'm very... <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. That was my whole box of diamonds um, just fell on the floor. So yeah, good times. <laughs> something else to clean up today that's okay it's clean up day it's all right just go with the flow let it roll off <laughs> sorry about that guys but yep lots to look forward to can't wait to play kingdom hearts 3 um i'm sure there are some other games out there but i just haven't had the time to really keep up with anything this month like it's just been so 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 busy but yes, I should be able to relax a little bit starting tomorrow. So I can't wait for that as well. Have a little bit of free time to actually think and such and breathe and diamond paint. Ha ha ha. But yes, good times. I'm all about being relaxed. Because you need to enjoy life. You can't enjoy life when you're super stressed out. That's my opinion. But yeah, I think this is all the relaxation I can muster up for today. <laughs> That's kind of sad, but kind of good. <laughs> I just need to get stuff done. And the quicker I can get it done, the better. And then maybe I can relax more this evening, which would be awesome. Especially now while I've got, you know, the gumption and the get up and go to do these things. I should probably get them done now. Because once it becomes uh, evening time and after dinner and all that, I really don't want to do anything. <laughs> at all. And I was like, I sometimes make list my to-do list. And I was like, yeah, I can do this after dinner and such and, you know, pew, pew, pew. And then... No, after dinner rolls around, I'm like, wait, what was I supposed to do? And I forget that I even had a to-do list. And yeah, that goes nowhere. So I have learned that about myself. If I want to get something done, if I need to get something done, I really need to do it before dinner. Yep, that's something I've learned. <laughs> All right, yep. More babbling for you guys, but yes, I hope that you have enjoyed. I hope that you um, were able to diamond paint and relax with me. This was just a little spot of relaxation. But yes, hope you have enjoyed and I will see you in the next video. Bye.